There you go. There you go. There you go. Position yourself right after. Let's see. Let me make sure it's focused right. Okay, welcome to episode. What's this? What episode is this? I don't know. You the fucking you the fucking director. Goddamn podcast. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, well, well, well. Don't try to keep me on the fucking podcast if you ain't gonna know how to podcast. I'm bro. You know podcast or what? And you are Miss Cookie. Yeah, well, well, well. Which way you gotta do it? Well, I'm uh. Anyway, well, I'm Miss Cookie. I'm bro. And welcome to Disturbingly Random, episode, bonus episode of season be two. Be potty, be potty, be potty. Okay. As you can see, the tables have turned, and um, this is a Halloween episode. So, I'm broke. <clears throat> I'm Miss Cookie. And so, what are we going to talk about today? Did you see what happened to Kevin Hart? I don't give a damn about Kevin Hart. You oh, believe we that shit? That last week. We talked about that last week. Didn't we? You believe that shit that's going on with I mean, Kevin Hart? Why wouldn't I believe it? Why if, would you? Why if, would you want if, to? If he said it happened. Because the shit don't add up. Stop being naive. Anyway. Next. Anyway. um, I wrote notes. I got notes. I'm reading my fucking notes. I read my notes. You always want somebody to keep notes and notes and everything, but then you don't want nobody to say no motherfucking notes. I'm saying my motherfucking notes. Okay, okay, I got notes. Okay, go. I got motherfucking notes. Okay, okay, okay. Get my hair, get my hair all done up. It's for nice. Shout out to Miss Biscuit and everything. Hey, beautiful hair someone. Miss Biscuit. Hey, beautiful. Shout out. Ram. Ram. And next. Thank you, Miss Biscuit, for the customized wig. Shout out to um to uh, KK Jewelers. <laughs> shout out to M J Makeup because <laughs> I do shout outs for every fucking thing, don't I? Ain't that what I'm supposed to do for them? You? <laughs> you shout out. Well, you shout out every sh- fucking I would thing. like to shout out. Still mad. I would sh- like to no, shout, I shout out. out that. I shout, no, when I'm you, I shout out all that too. Shout out to Still Mag, Fork Shank, and, 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 and Forks and Knives. And that's not how it go. How it go? Fork, Spoons, and Shanks. Whatever the fuck it is, it's the, his cookbook. Shout out, check it out because he got recipes in. Let's just be good. Anyway, round. <laughs> okay, next. So, you're fucking president. Why the Donald fuck is he Trump? my president? I don't give a fuck about him. Well, he he the one who be going to like the WC fights and the what's them fights when some people be fighting on the the UFC? Yeah, he go to the UFC fights and they be boring them and shit. Okay. He the one who be killing the um the what's them guys' names? The terrible Yeah. Bag Daddy. He be killing them. Bag Daddy. Yeah. Dad, daddy Pop. Daddy Pop. Daddy Pop. Bag Daddy. Bag Daddy. Mac Daddy. Yeah. Yeah, he be killing them. He killed all the oh, them people shit, she with the German me. Shepherd. Oh, why, but why did they trying to act like German Shepherds and anything? Why they try to act like German Shepherds and anything is new all of a sudden? Like when they know, like German, everybody had German Shepherds back in the days. Cause everybody ain't used to that. German Shepherd used to be the main killer dogs back in the day. Mm. You had one. Mm. The fuck? You all right? I did have a German Shepherd. Back in the days, thinking about it, I had to think about that for a second. You did? Yeah, I had a German Shepherd. Oh. Okay. But um, yeah, but they said the German Shepherd. What was we saying just now? You was talking about your president. Oh, yeah, the German Shepherds. Yeah, they said that we did have a German Shepherd. What did I just say? Oh, yeah, they, yeah, they said that the German Shepherd, he came. You didn't drink or smoke though? No, I don't drink no more. I'm saved. You saved? Oh, mm-hmm. shit. Saved. I've been saved. I've been saved. I've been saved. I've been saved. Say, say, I've been, I'm saved. I've been saved and everything for what? One, two, three, four, six weeks. No, three weeks. No. Did I say six weeks? Three weeks. Okay, oh. I've been saved for three weeks. And everything. Yeah, I, y'all feel so much like I got the weight slipped off of me. Y'all been saved for what? And everything. Um, 
Let's talk about why his president. Did you hear about Southwest Airlines? Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Let's talk about how his president moves to Florida and say it's supposed to be his first home, hometown. How do you feel about it? That's the same thing you saw when he went to the World Series and he um. That's your president. You tell me. Yeah, he went to the World Series and they booed him. Mm. That's just like Kanye West having his uh VIP section at the church. Passing out breakfast. Where DJ? Where you girl DJ at anyway? That's your people's. Hey, they, oh, that's what that was called. Shade. Well, Shade. Look. Shade. Maybe you throwing shit. Maybe she really. Maybe her, maybe her um her uh, Halloween costume is not being there. Maybe she a uh, 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 invisible person. Let me see, DJ. I guess so. You threw shade. Shade. You threw a shade. You throw a shade. Well, she ain't no longer part of the uh, podcast no more. No more disturbingly random. Next. I ain't saying nothing. I guess you told uh, her. Mm-hmm. You did. Shit. Okay. Anyway, anyway um, Southwest Airlines and everything, they had the guy. No, they kicked off the guy. Did you hear about that? They kicked off the guy on Southwest Airlines. Um, It was the, the, the well, they didn't kick off the guy. No, that um, oh, the uh, stewardess, she went on um, she went into the um cockpit and it, what's that thing? That that's a, the cockpit. That's woman, where the, where the, the pilots, pilots is at. Yeah, she so went in there. She went in there. Sucked there. his cock by in the cockpit. She probably did, but she then she told too. She told that she saw the video that they had the cameras inside the bathroom. They oh, so they can that. watch as you in the bathroom peeing. Uh huh. So you was doing the mile high, the mile high. Man, what's that? Called? That's the mile high. The Mile High Club and they think um the cock the uh the pilots they saw you in the in the cockpit. They That's that. against the law. Yeah, it's against the law. It's against the law to be doing the um the Mile High Club too. But they was watching. Hmm. hmm. Yeah, well, okay. We're moving right along. Oh, you don't care about that. Maybe you on the video. I ain't never been in the cockpit. You ever did the Mile High Club? No, I want to. You ever did it? Mm. Mm. Did you ever do it? Mm. I done mm. did a lot mm. in my days. Mm. Mm. Anyway, yeah. how you did a lot in your days? I did ten years. <laughs> what you did ten years in my high club? No, in jail. I ain't have to do that. They came to me. <laughs> in a mile high? Oh shit! Uh, you don't know? Shit! Uh... Bro, ask him. I'm OG, OG, and everything. OG, OG, and everything. Everything. You supposed to hit me every time I say anything. All right, all right, all right, all right. Bam, 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 bam. I like that, and I like that, and I like that. Just relax. I'm just adding them all up. I'm just adding them up. I don't need you to add them. I don't need you to add them all up. Just just a little now. That's it. We don't need you to be all knocking me out. Damn. Okay. When you gonna bring me some more of that cracked chicken? Oh, you like that crack chicken? You mm-hmm. like that crack chicken? Yeah, it's good. Oh, I'm gonna eat that crack, that crack chicken. Yeah. Where you, gonna, just, where you get it from again? No. 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 You ain't from there. You ain't from there, so don't try to act like you're from there. You ain't from no. You from the suburbs? No, I just used to sell. Yeah, you drugs from the suburbs? You from the suburbs? I just used don't to sell drugs. Give, don't nobody give a fuck about you selling no motherfucking drugs and no and anything. I, I used to sell drugs and no. I was out there. I, 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 don't nobody care about you selling drugs and no. And you wasn't there. Don't nobody even fucking care. Don't nobody care. There's you niggas. You live in the suburbs now. Anyway, moving right along. Okay, moving right along. Anyway. So what I was saying, I'll bring you cracked chicken. Damn. And sweet potato cake. Yeah. That, that's it. What else you want? Damn. Why are you so hostile? What's the matter? Because, you know what I'm saying? It's niggas, it's, it's, niggas always want to want more than what they, you, know, you tell them that you're going to give them something. All of a sudden, they want to give you, you, I don't crack chicken. I don't want sweet potato cake. And they think, want pussy too? Damn. It's like, damn, what else you want? Wow. The fuck? Woo. You You're just like your motherfucking friend. Like your fucking friend, Adam. Damn. You and Adam got a love-hate relationship. No, you do. You do. You fucking love Adam. That's your boy. You love him. Always want to say he's doing a podcast. He pop... Where he at now? Where he at now? He ain't podcasting. Yeah, he just like fuck, fucking DJ. Where the fuck DJ at? 
DJ and Adam. You on a roll tonight, huh? Yeah, oh, pretty. Shit. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. What, what's the What's the matter? No, I gotta fucking work tomorrow. Them fucking kids get on my fucking nerves. Oh. Anyway. Well, I gotta I gotta get up at five in the morning and drive trucks. Anyway, well, that's your business. You chose that life. <sighs> fucking kids get on my nerves. Um. What's, what's, what else you want to talk about? I wrote my notes. Didn't you write your fucking notes? Don't you have your paper over there? You always got your paper over there, your stupid ass paper. I I decided not to have the papers today. Anyway, yeah. Well, I, I got, well, I, well today. today I got my papers. You know what I mean, do you use, do you, when you put the toilet tissue on a roll, do you, like, which way do you put it? Do you put it with the roll to the, towards the wall or on the outside? You pull the paper down. Which way? On, against the wall or on the outside towards you? I don't fucking know. Yeah, you don't really care, do you? No, as long as I'm wiping my yeah, you're ass. Just like a fucking nigga. Niggas always don't never. What care. side do you put the toilet tissue roll on then? The side that makes the women happy. But which is the side, side that I like. But what side is that? The side towards the uh, outside. So what's the outside? Rolling outside. So that's rolling Basically, over. You're over. Why you put it that way? Yo, I swear to God, you motherfuckers kill me. You pee on the toilet too, don't you? Mm. No. Yes, you do. No. You're just like my fucking son. I hate you, Jesus. Whew. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, exactly. Anyway. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's, it's a cold world. Cold war out here in this world. I'm telling you. That's why I got my hat on. People <laughs> like you, boy. Woo, woo. What's this? <laughs> I'm losing it. I'm losing my. I'm losing my stomach. Don't worry about it. I be trying to lose my stomach. I want to get tummy tuck. I want to get a tummy tuck. Well, why don't you? Let's go to the gym. That's all you gotta do is work out. You motherfuckers try to make me get a go for me. You a jerk, yo. He a jerk. He didn't never see the shirt. <laughs> he, he ain't never seen the shirt. You jerk. <laughs> you an idiot. You an idiot. <laughs> yo. <laughs> you an yo. Idiot. I'm fucking. Yo. I'm done. <laughs> Yo, I'm absolutely done. Yo, y'all are retarded. Yo, let's finish thing like this. Yo, I'm done. Oh, shit. Yo, stay like that. Just keep being me. Okay. Keep it up. I want to see how this goes. Okay. Before we can go with this. Okay. Holy shit. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, let's get back. <laughs> how, how, how does it feel to see yourself? <laughs> this is look crazy. Um, it's a war going on out there. War going on the Cold War. Cold War. Cold War. It's a Cold War. Cold War. Word. Word. Um, yo, you remember when um, remember, remember when Cookie was saying to you that um, how your old heads be grabbing and everything. I mean, how mm-hmm. like the women, the girls want to be, be mm-hmm. grabbing. What the hell I mean? Snatching it, like what? Who you think you're talking to? Old head snatch different. How old that. head snatch? You just getting some cookie off me. Um, how, how old heads? They snatch a little different. How they snatch? I don't know. I saw that shit the other day, and they think they be trying. They be they. They don't do that. They do this. They point. They don't snatch. Oh, they. Mhm. I saw that shit on the um on on uh, uh on the own network with uh nephew Tommy. Nephew Tommy got a show. I remember I told you about the show he had before. I don't like it. With the women. I don't like it. It's the same show again? Same show again. Oh, he I, got a new one. No, it's the same show again. No, I'm saying a new season. I don't care. I don't know. But it's, I don't like it. I don't like those desperate women. I seen a woman. I seen a chick on there that I know. I seen a chick that I know. You serious? Day. Yeah, Tandy. I seen Tandy Gallant. How you there. know her? I know her. She did plays and she kind of did plays with, uh, uh, with Kenya Moore. 
Yeah, yeah, the hot, real housewives yeah, 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 of Atlanta. Yeah, yeah. My dude used to mess with Kenya Moore. And they, 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 you know, they was tight. They was cool. Oh. And Tondi was friends with her, and they, they did plays together. And Tondi was with uh, Genuine later on down the line, I believe. But um, Get on it. Let's do it. Ride it. My pony. John. Okay. Yeah. Um. So... Tandy, Tandy's on there, and I seen her, and and I, I really want. I hope that Tandy's just playing a role, or just you know faking it for that show. Do you think these women be getting no day like how they get their what five minutes of fame, like how delicious and all said. them did? That's what I just said. I hope that Tandy's just doing that for that. Yeah, I hope so. I hope so. Maybe she's really looking for love. I hope the guy that she was up against real close and anything is the one she's looking for looking for love from. Hmm. I hope not. Um, but who am I? Who am I to say who's the guy who's right for a woman? Who the hell am I, right? Yeah, who are I'm you? I'm a dude. How the hell? I'm, you I'm can't a dude. I should predict never, and tick and But I should never dictate. say. I should <laughs> predict and dictate. I should never say that, you know what I'm saying, who's the right one for a woman. Because I'm a dude and everything. So that means like I'm judging another dude, right? Yeah, how do you know who is right for somebody? Ain't that crazy? Like a dude, when another dude judges uh, another dude for a woman, he should get the hell out of the business, right? Ain't nobody tell you to get into business. Oh, gee, why not? Hey, rest in peace, John Witherspoon. Oh, pa. Dang, dang, dang. I got a picture I took with him, me and him and Caroline. Oh, yeah? I would never... Why didn't you post it? Fake ass, social media ass? Why didn't you post it? Because I was sick. I got to find it. You were sick, so you didn't post it? Mm-hmm. It only takes two fingers. I got to find the picture. So you were sick and you couldn't find it? Mm-hmm. Because it takes two fingers to find it? I had to get up and look for the pictures, not in my oh, phone. Oh, it's not as back that far. Yeah. Back when social media wasn't popping. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. You just want to take a picture of it? Yeah. And then Caroline's. It. So it's like a, it's a Polaroid? Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's a real picture. Right? Classic. Classic. Like him in them shoes. That too. That too. Damn, rest in peace, John Witherspoon, though, man. Yo, mm-hmm. He was 77 years old. I wonder what happened to him. I don't know. They say he died in his, um, his, in his, in his house. In his house. Yeah, that's a, that's a good place to die, though. When you pass away. If you die around your loved ones and anything in a place that you're comfortable with, that's a that's a good place. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, rest in peace, though. I hope he's alright. I hope his family's good. Yeah. Hey, um, you ever travel for sex? What? You ever travel for sex? Ain't nobody said that. Ain't nobody send me no flight ticket to go get him some pussy. All right, keep it real. You ever went to the next town over for a dude who was like, "Yo, come through"? What do you oh, mean next town over? You know what I mean? Like, if I live in Newark and you live in Irvington? Yeah. You kind of did that shit. So you travel for sex. I was it was it there. worth it though when you went <coughs> when, when you traveled over there? Did you get when you got there? You was like, yo, I'm glad I got up out my bed and came through. Maybe a couple times. Fam, you'll never be at home when I go cut your son's hair anyway. So when you be getting up in the morning early, nigga, I was doing take care of business. I had to get my hair. That's done. business. That's what I mean. Yeah. You ever get up early in the morning to go take care of business? Anything in the next town over? Yeah, go get my hair done. Oh, get your hair. That's what you call it. Get your hair done. That's taking care of business. You what the hell, business? You ever, you ever, you ever <laughs> Don't drink water and anything for time to think. Hey, did you? This is classic. Women swing the light over your head too and anything, and like it's interrogating. No. <coughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. go ahead. Because I'm trying to understand what you're getting at. Do you ever fucking travel for sex? Is what I'm I saying. I just told you. You asked me, did I go to How another far? time? How far would you go to travel for sex? Back in the days, me and my brother, we was crazy enough to go to other states. Like, oh, I never do that. We was halfway across the United States. We're going to go travel and everything because some chicks was like, so calm, calm, calm. And we were like, yo, we're going to come through. And we would get in the truck, we're in the car and just drive for like 15 minutes. No, I ain't do that. 15 um, hours just to go No, I ain't chicks. never had no long distance relationship. It wasn't a relationship. Well, a long distance sex partner. It wasn't a partner. It was like, then we what would you call it? We was going over to the smash. Well, I we never had out. a long distance fuck partner then. Oh. All right. I'm just asking. That's no, I didn't. So that's crazy to do that. <clears throat> No, it's to each his own. <coughs> you think Kanye was like black people? What? <laughs> Why you get like that? Yo, when I said Kanye West, yo, you got real different because you went to the Sunday service thing now. And I ain't been there. <clears throat> he, I don't want to go there. Do you think he like black people? Because he said that George Bush ain't like black people. Do you think he like black people? You think Kanye West is self-sabotaging and anything to black people? I think he's confused right now. He is. He still haven't gotten over the fact of his mother passed. I think it's linked to that. All of this mm-hmm. nonsense that he's doing. He can't get right. Mm. He I, don't have no immediate family to help guide him. I think. I think. Um. I think Kanye is. A, he, like, he 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 got a, He's out of tune with his black side. 
I'll go with that. So I think Kanye looking. He at don't me. have no. He don't. He don't have. <clears throat> who can he go to right now? Nobody. You don't never hear him talk about none of his family on his mother or his father's side, which is the black side. You don't hear none of that. I think Kanye West looks in the mirror and he don't like himself right now. So anything that looks. So like, that's why for Halloween he was in all them stupid costumes. I think anything that looks like him is bothersome to him. I'm gonna think about so just he, like Kanye next year. How will you do that? Then you be Kim. No, no. How will you do that? What do you mean? How will you dress like Kanye? Um, you gonna do fun like a horse's ass and anything and just put that on? You know what I'm saying? Like on you gonna like wear a jackass outfit? Well, damn. He's a jackass. No. He's I a was jackass. gonna use the new the old Kanye before he got married. Teddy bear. Mm-hmm. Have my wop, my, 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 my talk like that. He made mad money though. They said he made like a hundred something million dollars. He had uh, <clears throat> he was in what? debt like off of music and all types of shit. Off of stupid. But how music. was he in debt and what? Stupid. How was he like in 30 debt? Thirty something thousand, thirty something million in debt, but he made a hundred something million. How was why and how was he in debt? What it cost he money to make money? That's why. He was the only person I ever heard that was. He in spent thirty something million to make a hundred something million. That's what he's saying. So he wasn't in debt. No, he's he not in it. debt. No, that's not. That's what I'm saying. He's not in debt, but it cost him. He had thirty something million dollars in debt. But he made a hundred something million dollars. So he made a hundred hundred million dollars. Just to say that. Okay. He had hundred million dollars last year, two thousand eighteen. And I can't even fucking make a hundred thousand dollars. <throat> but people always subscribe to his nonsense. If you so make, why if the you, hell they don't made, subscribe to the disturbingly random podcast? Get out there and push that. I'll be pushing that shit. I'll be pushing it like back in the days you in the eighties. But you can't <laughs> like crack in the eighties. Like, yo, but you can't push it to your friends. You can't push it to your friends. Your friends don't, your friends don't really care. So who am I supposed to push it to? The people who ain't your friends. The new people. The people you meet every day. You just mm-hmm. bump into somebody and be like, hey, how you doing? Da, da, da. Just, hey, check out this Urban Random Podcast. Can't we make flyers and put them shits up? Flyers, t-shirts, cards. That's what we going next next season. We going there. We going to into merch. We going to do merchandise. Yeah. People might, people will buy that shit too. They will. Even if, if even if they didn't look at the podcast, just yeah. because it's terribly random. Yeah. Hey, um, if you had a lot of money, if you if you had the, the Kanye West money, what would you what would you spend like? What 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 would be the first things you spent money on if you had money like that, a hundred million? First thing I would do is pay off my student loans and my kids' um, loans, so they don't have to worry about being in debt like that mm-hmm. for college. I want that all paid off completely first. Because that's the most thing that'll hinder your credit. That college, college, college. Hell is. yeah. Mm. I I got a, a student loan now. I got to pay. It ain't even working in the field. Mm. Yo, LeBron, what would you do, LeBron James? I, I I'm gonna get to me in a minute, but I think LeBron James. Like I seen an episode of uh, of the shop with What's LeBron that? James. He did this thing. Hey, he stole my idea. Another guy that stole my idea. Um, the shop. Um, where he sits around the barbershop and, you know, they got a b- bunch of guys there. They happen to be, you know, sports people, celebrities and whatever like that, um, whether it's music or sports. And they talk, they have conversations about stuff that's going on in, in you know, like current events. So why you, you still do it? Did that. Did that a long time ago. I got videos from them, way back in the days, from back in MySpace days. Just to prove uh, That was when, Just to prove I it. remember, that's when I got, yeah, had I got asked videos. me a question. And I, I, got, yeah, I got mad videos from that. <laughs> um... I'll pull. I'll, I'll show him to you. Um, anyway, you know. Um, so LeBron, he got this show. You know, um, LeBron should cut me a check for that, huh? You get a check for that. I say. I say you go for it. Go for it. Um, but he got a show, and LeBron got a hairline now. And LeBron, we we all know that LeBron didn't have a hairline for a long time. That what do thing, you mean? It, wait, that thing was back here, and that thing was all missing off. So it's like what I got on my face then. Oh, that ain't real. <laughs> That's what he got. He got the real real. He got that thing all the way up here. It can't be. It's up there. It's what, up they there. cut his skin and put hair in it? Man, listen. Man, when you got money, you can get anything you want. That's my point. That's my point. Like, so if I had a lot of money, and anything you think I shouldn't get it? You think I should get a hairline? No, man. No. Hell no. No? No. You're going to fuck it up. You look better like that. All right. <laughs> Damn, I was, I was just trying to get a hairline. Nah. So, nah. Nah. Don't do it. Hell Spend no. my money elsewhere. Yeah. Okay. That shit will look stupid, and I'm going to tell you you look stupid, and I might not want to be bothered with you. Okay. So I wouldn't even be a podcast buddy. No, I don't know. Because you had to put a, you had to keep your uh, going to war hat on. <laughs> going to war hat on. Yeah. Going to 
wearing, but you wearing it now. That's that's for today. Hey, um, what else I got on here? I got some stuff. I got a couple more things to touch up on before we get the hell out of, out of here. We gave these people a bonus episode for Halloween. That's dope. Ain't that some shit? Yeah, we did that for Christmas. Remember with the ugly sweaters? Did we? That was a bonus episode? I don't know. Was it? Probably so. Probably don't nobody so. do it like us. Man, that's crazy. Um, See, this is what happened when you try to give somebody a chance to be a part of the set and they don't commit, you got to destroy their ass and let them go. Damn. You're on, you're on, you're on kill mode. You back I'm just saying. Up. You're on kill mode. So next next episode, is going to be a different setting and everything. It's going to be real Next different. season? Yeah. Next season. Um, yeah, that's going to be three seasons. Three seasons. We're going to three seasons. How many think? How many think? How, how many do you think we're gonna get to ten? I don't know. We are gonna keep going until we until we stop going. All right. Make them kill us. We are gonna make them kill us. Let's we'll just keep going until they kill us. Hmm. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Na 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 na. Let me say uh uh na 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 na. Say uh uh na 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 na. Uh oh. <laughs> yo, yo, I hope I asked you something. I don't know if I can ask you with that on. <laughs> with, with this one, it's, it's so funny asking you. <laughs> but Because you asked yourself? No, I'm not, yeah, I'll be asking myself. I'm skipping it. No, um, ask me. No, I'm just, I'm, no. I'm not about like, it was like about a female. Okay. I don't want to. I don't want to. <laughs> Would you like me to take my hat off? Nah, just chill. chill. Still got the beard. Still got the beard. Oh. And, um, all right. I was going to say this before we go. Anything, all right? We make this um this episode short since it's a, a bonus episode. We ain't going to wait people out. We're just going to um, give them some time to... Uh, no, this was the entertainment episode for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bonus entertainment episode. Um, this is what I realized about people. Anything, all right? And everything. You see, I took it. I took that from you. Mm-hmm. I I know this is about people. Um, and this I know this is not just about people with this season. Is this like your word of wisdom at the end of the end of the show? You know, how you have like a uh, a word of wisdom, a quote for the people. Uh, so, so, sort of dealing but, with something. But you know how you notice how like you know what I'm saying when you when you're around people for a while or you do something for a while, you start to make sense of a lot of things in life or whatever. Um. Or you start um, figuring out all the lessons that you've learned over time or whatever. Um, what I've learned is that a lot of people don't really understand how to how to um, nourish relationships. Whether it be friendships, whether it be relationships, whether, you know, no matter what. You love it's like Example. Well, most people... talking to me. You know I need examples. I got you. I got you. Um... And I'm gonna I'm, I'm get the hell up off of this paper and everything because I just had a bullet point and everything and to point that out because I, I, I thought about this the other day. But it's like a lot of people they complain about um, they don't have they don't know how to find the right person to be in a relationship with or they don't get the right people don't come their way or they don't approach them or whatever have you. Or you see people with a, a small list of friends or whatever like that. And we tell ourselves that you know what. Um, um, I don't have a lot of friends and anything, you know what I'm saying, because it's better that way, or Jesus only had 12 disciples, and all of that stuff like that. We, we always go through that whole thing, or whatever. But if you're a likable person, then a lot of people like you, mm-hmm. or whatever like that. But I think that a lot of people don't really know how to be liked. I think that a lot of people don't know how to be in relationships. I think that a lot of people don't know how to be friends. I can agree, because I don't, I don't think I know how to be in a relationship right now. And that's cool to say that, and anything. So... With that being said, it's just you got to work on those little things that might make people, you know what I'm saying, gravitate towards you more. And you can't just write it off as being say, as, as just saying like, well, I don't really give a shit. I don't really give a fuck and anything and don't like me. I'm just going to be me or whatever That's like you. that. No, because at the end of the day, if you really can't subscribe, like if you really not true to that, if you really don't really know how to stand on that island by yourself mm-hmm. or whatever like that, then you got to be careful what you, you know what I'm saying, what you claim it. Are you talking to DJ? Well, it could be fine too. Oh. You know what I mean? Um you know what I'm saying? It's like it's like like I said, people people they I think that people are bankrupt when it comes to to um to the necessary tools to be a good friend. 
when it comes to it's, it's like yo they want support they want mm-hmm. friends mm-hmm. but then when you got somebody who gives all of the the necessary things to them you know what i'm saying for a good friendship for you know what i'm saying um for great support or whatever like that they don't really know how to handle it how to garnish it and anything mm-hmm. and deal with it and 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 use it and anything to their to their best degree to the best degree or whatever so then you start seeing them fighting and 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 pushing harder and harder than anything in a direction that means nothing or whatever you know what I'm saying? and i know you know who i'm talking about without me saying names you know what i mean so they keep repeating themselves over and over again or whatever like that you know what i mean so it's like the lesson that I've learned, <laughs> so it's like the lesson that, and, and it might not apply to just them the people who you think in your head but it's like the lesson that I've learned in anything over time and anything is that um, a lot of people, they don't really know how. So, like, I stop being mad at people. I just start letting them be who they are. You know what I mean? Um, just allow them to be who they are and anything, you know what I'm saying? You take a deep breath and you step back and you can just continue to be who you are. You know what I mean? Um, and that's the, that's the lesson in anything on life. You just got to be like, Because you know, you're going to cross paths again. You're going to cross paths in anything or whatever. Um, and anything. I keep saying that. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, you hit, thanks. Thanks me for hitting me. Mm-hmm. I appreciate that. And um, everything. And everything. Um, so, I, that, that, that's the lesson that I've learned. Um, you know, you just got to let people be who they are. Well, I you learned know. the lesson this season. What you learned? I learned to not really care because at the end of the day, people is not paying my rent and taking care of me. So, who gives a fuck what they think? And can't nobody tell my story but me? So, you write a book? Huh? It's on the, it's, it's, it's I always say table. that when you, when, you, when you start feeling like can't nobody tell your story but you that means that you gotta tell your story it's on the table can I ask you something sure if you be in me why you got lip gloss on cause I don't like my lip draw oh. ready let's do the let's... biscuit says I don't do that you so, do do so it so you know um Yo, man. Um, the biscuit was dead wrong for cutting my wig up to make it for you. Oh, but that was you. That was a good you. I was a better you than you. I was a better you than you. I was a better you than you. And that was a better you than you. I actually watch when people ask about me. Like, ask about me. Why is you doing that, though? Why do you keep touching your stomach? That's not me. I'm just fine. Oh, man. That's the end of this episode, man. We done. I'm fired. I'm not messing with you like that no more. Until mm-hmm. next season. I'm Ro. Miss Cookie. Yeah, round. What? Round? 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 You're supposed to put the hat back on. I'm the wig. <laughs> the wig. <laughs> back on. Round? Round? Yo, we out, man. Yo, see you next season. Yo, we out.